So we got some puffins down here. I'm, uh, I'm gonna go get set up down here. Here about 40 minutes um, and all I've done is photograph the puffins here on this rock and uh, see the, the cliff edge coming down here and along this rock got some lovely shots of them um, kind of the boat they've blurred out foreground and background and getting low against here portrait shots of the puffins and uh, some full body shots as well and also on this rock um, there's one photo absolutely love um, I'll try to show you on the back of the camera here but uh, he's just on that rock and he's opening his mouth giving a bit of a yawn love that shot so I'm gonna move on now I'm gonna try to get some in-flight shots and the puffins are swooping in here and landing up here so uh, and also this rock down here a nice big black rock so I can get the puffins swooping down uh, nice black background really make the colors pop that's what I'm after so I'm gonna stay here for another 20 minutes half an hour so you can get some in-flight shots so. stick on the uh, 18 to 55 mil Let's see if I can get some uh, wide angle shots of these guys with the cliff face um, let's see if it works I'd say they'll just they might just fly away but sure here we'll give it a go while we're up when in Rome when in Rome
nice shot of the puffin on the rock, kind of with the cliff face, um, kind of leading out to the sea. So I'm finished with the puffins, but I'm making my way over to the gannets now. I only have 45 minutes until the boat's back to pick us up. Just had a quick look at the puffin photos. Had some uh, some nice portraits, got some nice in-flight shots, and some nice uh, images of the puffins on the cliff face, kind of like blowed out foreground and background, and uh, got some nice shots with the wide angle 18 mil so happy enough i'm gonna rush over here to the gannets they're just up the cliff face up here and the puffins are all the way back there so i'm gonna rush over here before my time is up look at all those gannets wow look at them all swarming in Beautiful as that. Look. Amazing. Right. I don't have long, so I'm going to try and get some photographs of these gannets. Such a beautiful bird, those gannets. And they're massive. You can see them they're just all chilling out. So I got a quite a few shots. The uh, I'll show you as quickly. The one shot I really like, and uh, the gannet is just flying in, and he's um, full wingspan just showing off kind of everything about them the large wingspan um, you know the, the black on the tip of the wings the white and you can see the blue eye and the kind of um, creamy head see them there look oh. so there he is just flying in So oh, that's a wrap and I am sweating from running around like a mad thing. Three hours on the island is definitely not enough. You'd spend a whole day here if you could but the boat's coming back to get me now. I spent so long with the puffins this morning, two and a half, probably two hours and 15 minutes I spent with the puffins and uh, I only had 15 minutes over there with the gannets so but uh with the puffins love the images i got had another look at the back of the camera and um, the gannets didn't get many shots but i got one shot of the gannet kind of flying in i showed you earlier absolutely love that photo and uh, it's just completely blended into the sky in the background and uh, love it can't wait to get that home to the computer but uh, i didn't get much footage of the birds this time because i just wanted to concentrate on getting some images and uh, you'd want to be fit running around here i'm too used to sitting in hides Back for the boat as well, so we 
want to be waiting on me. Sorry. But I think I got distracted by all the gannets. Which is completely understandable. Anyhow, I think I'm a bit deluded for this weather. But, hope you've enjoyed it. I had a blast. I love coming over here. I'll be uh, throwing the images over on the Instagram, as always. Sean Mead Photography. I'll put a link in the description below. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you on the next one.